Greetings, fellow adventurers. This is Venture, and welcome back to my Skyrim adventure. We're it's still in a cave somewhere. Not exactly the most beautiful of sceneries to start a video in, but it's where we left off the last video, so I don't know what else to do but like continue this cave. I don't even know what we're doing, what we're trying to do. Apparently, we're trying to find a sealed heart in the ground, and we're opening it with our keys that we have. I think. That's as much as I know. Yeah, I feel like I'm kind of out of the loop, especially for being the main character of this here quest line. I, I, I don't know. I'm, I'm, oh, I thought we had all. I mean, I don't have all these, but how could there? What the heck is that shout? I've never got that one before. Did I? Did they add another shout in with this DLC? That would be so cool. Anyway, everyone's still here. No one's dead. Aqua's still alive. Actually, Aqua has managed to live through a lot. It would be kind of ironic if the strongest animal companion we've ever had is actually a puppy. He was literally born yesterday. Well, he wasn't, but, you know, it's like yesterday plus a couple months. Whoa! Scared me out to death. What the heck is that thing? Oh, it's one of you. Stupid little things always sneaking up on me. How can you sneak up on me? You sound so loud. You're like someone stuck a you Ruby's Cube in a blender and turned it on and... Whoa! What in the heck did... What is causing all these things to turn on? This is not cool. This is not cool. Anyway, hi. How you guys doing? It's been a little while since I recorded Skyrim, so I'm a little bit out of practice. But hey, you guys are looking good. It's good to see you all again. Um, I'm, I'm glad you could join me on this here adventure that is less of an adventure and more of me going through caves for episodes at a time. But I'm trying to get out of a cave. I know you guys don't want to see me in a cave the entire time, but it's a lot harder to get out of a cave than you might expect. What in the world? Oh, yay. Someone died here. That's lovely. I really need to start using the sonic screwdriver again, but it would be way too much work and take way too much time to try and get it out of my inventory and charge it again, so I'm just not going to do it. Actually, it's probably already charged, but still too much work. I don't do physical labor. No. Actually, lockpicking would technically go under physical labor, so I guess I just contradicted myself, which I do a lot. Oh, come on, please. I don't got... <laughs> that was hilarious. Yes, that was a uh, taste of his own medicine, so to say. Who invented that trap anyway? It was a kind of a fail, like, these blades will spring from the floor and cut down our own centurion before he can do any damage, and then the blades disappear and nothing actually happened. I don't know. It sounds like a funhouse ride or something. All right, I'm just making sure there's not anything I'm missing. Um, apparently we're looking for, what is it, like, Chamber of the Hawk? How do you know there's trouble ahead? Tell you, how do you know? What do your elf eyes see? I don't see anything. It looks like it's the same hallway we came from. I swear all these hallways are the same ones. They just keep copying and pasting them over. Ooh, hello. Books. I don't really want to read, but... Dresser, why not? A, a wonderful... Dresser! The dressers are where you put fashions! Oh, did I just take something? Crap, I'll give it to Poet. I'll give it... Poe, I, I got some dwarven stuff for you. Here. I accidentally picked it up. Right behind you. But, um, happy not your birthday. It's actually... I don't know if it has anything to do with anything, but here. I've got you a nice big... Here, take that too. You maybe you can do something with it. Here, can you carry any of this junk? Here, I've got dwarven crap. I've been carrying for what? Here, take a bowl. Make something out of that bowl. Um, where's where's that dwarven crap? I was with? oh dwarmer dw dwimmer pan, dwimmer. Okay, d here, just here. Here's a goblet. Make, make yourself something nice. Make yourself oh, I would jug. Man, why do I have this crap in my inventory? Paper lantern. Um, anything else? Oh, some plates. Uh, some Pokeballs. No, I'll keep those. And an ox head. Make something nice out of that ox head. I expect to see, like, the best furnishings ever. Like, make a couch out of it or something. So I could snuggle with my dead ox head while I watch a movie. Not that we've invented movies yet, but you know. Actually, Poe, get on that. Invent mu movies. Go invent movies. So I can go see Winter Soldier. Okay, which way am I going? This way? Why is this one already dead? Why is it dead? Did it do it? Oh, they're all dead! Great. Well, I guess I'd rather them be dead than alive and killing me. Oh, I got some arrows. Did I already kill these? I don't think so. I've never killed these things. Ooh, apples. Okay. Wait, I should probably take those. People are going to yell at me in the comments if I don't. People are going to yell at me if I don't. Anyway, people. People in the comments have been telling me that I need to go and find Jin and Anna pronto. Like, very fast. And I'm like, okay. I'm going to have to do that as soon as I get out of this cave. 
I was planning on finishing this DLC quickly, but it's kind of long. It's longer than I was expecting. Ready your swords, ladies and gentlemen, and dogs. We have one dog. I have to include the dog now in my speech. Wow, that was quick. You guys are getting good at this. I don't have to do anything anymore. I've got so many followers following me. Uh, every time I walk past Elsa, I get the chills. It's like, ugh. You gotta stay at least 15 feet away from her, or else it feels like the air conditioning's all too high. Oh, hello. Uh, final lesson. I really would not want to read my final lesson. I've already graduated. Oh, hey, Todd. Yeah, you're looking good. It's been a while since we've seen you. What have you been up to? Killing the local squirrel population? Actually, come to think of it, I haven't seen any squirrels in Skyrim. How could Sky Skyrim not have squirrels? Everywhere in the world has squirrels. I'm pretty sure Antarctica has, like, Arctic squirrels. It's like the most common animal on Earth. Or, I think. I don't know. Hello. Well, it's really nice that these, these lights run for, like, centuries down here. Never need to power them, never need to turn them off. It's wonderful. If only we could invent something like that, so I wouldn't have to constantly remember to turn off the bathroom light when I leave. Oh, hello. Whoa! You might not want to walk in there. How do I turn it off? Uh, hang on a second. You might want to move. You're kind of cooking yourself. Wait. Okay, it's done. It's done. It's done. It's done. Please don't step on the button again. Oh, oh come on. They're all going to, one at a time, step on that button and kill themselves. It's one of them days. I think it's just one of them days. Oh, great. Okay. Just come on. Come on. I know we I know we got to deal with it one at a time. Okay. Poe, what, what are you on? Are you on some kind of vitamin supplement or something? What the heck? You are wiping out these things faster than anybody else in the entire group, and you're not a warrior. I know for a fact you're not. Have you been, like, taking jujitsu classes or something in your, like, free time? I don't know. I mean, I know you've taken the whole losing Lydia thing pretty hard, and especially the pets, but you are kicking all kinds of butt lately, and I don't know what's causing that, because you used to, you'd run and you'd hide, and you wouldn't even be involved in anything, but now you were destroying everything. I'm trying to think maybe Merrick has something to do with that, or Freya, but Freya's been in such a, like, such a breakdown recently over Lydia. I don't think she'd train anybody. I mean... If training involves chopping their heads off and screaming at their dead bodies, maybe. But she's just a little bit on edge lately, so we try not to talk directly to her. Or else, bad things could happen. Okay, well, um... Wait a minute. I just made a sudden discovery. Where's this rubble coming from? Okay, well, this hallway is obviously, you know, broken. But, clearly, this rubble is laying on the floor. Like, oh, you got a pillar and you got the pieces of the wall. Where are they coming from? These walls and pillars are perfectly intact. Now, instead, you're telling me that entire hallway got pulled all the way out here. What caused that? I don't know. It seems a little odd to me. It seems suspicious. What could this possibly be for? Like, who builds this? It's like, oh, let's build an urn, but let's make it flat. Make it, like, so you can't actually put anything into it. It's solid inside. And we're going to sit books on it for no apparent reason right in the middle of a hallway where no one would ever need to store books or read them. Just put them there. It looks nice, right? It doesn't look nice. It looks out of place. Oh, what? I, sto I stepped on something. Sorry, everyone, I keep stepping on things. Oh, and I'm supposed to give Merrick, um, a cloak? But I don't have any. I mean, I have... Wait, what's this? Oh, that's the one I'm wearing. Uh, here, I have a, a crimson hide. Would red look good on Merrick? Maybe it would. I am Dot. Shut up and let me give you your lovely, lovely cloak. Oh, you're going to work it so well. Look at that. Oh, you look fabulous. You look very kingly, Merrick. Very kingly. The red actually does suit you very well, I think. It goes perfectly with your brownish colors of brown and stuff. You look wonderful. Um, you kind of look like a Bionicle now that I'm thinking about it. If anyone even knows what Bionicle is. That, man, that died off a long time ago. That was my childhood, man. Now it's like Hero Factory or something. I'm like, what's Hero Factory? It doesn't even make sense. Bionicle was a cool name because you're like, what is a Bionicle? It's a biomechanical. Is that what it means? Bio, bionicle, biomechanical. Is that? I think I just made like a, a revelation to myself right there. Did, I did not know that. I literally did not know that. Is that what it means, or does it mean something else? And I totally am on the wrong path. I don't know. Uh, I don't know how I got. It. Oh, I'm mildly everything. You can live, Vale. Just, just choke it up and be a man or a woman, I guess, because most of the men in our party have been complete whips. Okay. Um. Wait. Whatever happened to other me? Did we see other me recently? I can't remember. But I don't know where he's been. Uh, and other Vale, she's around here too. Tur like, she's tormenting everyone with that ugliness in her face. This is the longest cave I've ever been in. It feels like we are just running through it. 
and there's no end to it at all, like ever. Like, is it going to end? Is it going to have a nice end? Are we going to get a little celebration? We're going to have to jump on the top of the flag to get an extra 10,000 points and an extra one up? <laughs> that is how it works in Skyrim, right? When you just, okay. Hello. Oh, goody. Big. There's a big nasty in there. There's a big nasty. That's okay. I'll shoot it from this distance. I'm going to have to start using shouts again, too. I keep forgetting. Okay, how about the big nasty? Oh, I hit him. I hit him. I hit him. Come on. Okay, that's not going to work. Oh, hey, America. Just crouching around? Cool, me too. Uh, shouts. Give me shouts. Um, I need to activate some of these other ones. It's just, they don't sound very, you know, cyclone. Why not? I mean, come on. It's a cyclone. How awesome could that be? Come get some for my cyclone breath. It didn't seem to do anything. It's like a weaker Futrada. Oh. Ouch. I feel for that Dwarven Sagerian. He's not even human and probably can't even feel pain, but that hurt. His, his ancestors are going to feel that. Not that dwarves have ancestors. I mean, they're built. They're not born. Are they? I don't know. Are they a race of robots that give birth? That doesn't even make any sense. I never understood that. Like, how do the Autobots, like, have more of them? Like, do they just build each other? Then who built the first one? Where'd the first Autobot come from? Or Decepticon? And uh, can, uh, can, do Autobots ever build Decepticons? Like, oh, well, there's too many Autobots and not Decepticons. The PvP's getting a little one-sided. Maybe we should build some Decepticons for once. I mean, do they do that, or are they trying to wipe them all out? I don't know. Why am I talking about that? What am I looking for? The heart chamber. Oh, I'm looking for this book. Um, well, there's words. Lots of words. Letters, making up words that make up sentences. And paragraphs, and... Looks awesome. Okay, I'll take that. Return the book to... Uh, what? What do you mean, return it to somebody? I thought we were looking for it in here. Are you telling me we weren't even looking for it this entire time? We're trying to get a stupid book? I don't come all this way for a stupid book. Come on, I don't even read. I don't even think I know how to read. Okay, whatever. I'm calm. I can deal with this. It's a little bit disappointing to know that we aren't actually looking for the secret chamber of the hearts or anything, but I can deal with that. It's not like I'm going to have a breakdown or start throwing things because I didn't get my chamber of the hearts like I was promised. Instead, we spent like an episode and a half in there walking around for nothing more than a stupid book. Come on. We can do this. It looks gorgeous outside, though. It's nice to see outside again. I've been down there for so long. The darkness was starting to make me feel like I was a vampire, or a zombie, or an MMO player. Hello. Um, I guess that's everything? Are we done here? Wow, that was really anticlimactic, actually. We were down there looking through that heck of long cave and didn't get anything out of it. Oh, well. I guess it was time well spent. No, it wasn't. I didn't get anything out of that. That was time not well spent. The entire last episode and a half could have been erased. And that thing would have been lost. We only would have gained a book. No one cares about books. I don't even check my book inventory. I probably have things in there that I don't even know. Oh, I'm feeling a bit fatigued. Shut up, Vale. You, you will do what I say. Okay, well, that's a rock. Um, should I walk or just fast travel? I should probably fast travel, but I've been in a cave so long. I'm tired of fast traveling and looking at kids. Shut up! I am not in the mood. You go away and... Yes, thank you. Very well. Stay dead. Crawl back in the hole you came from. Go back to your world. Is there like a world of entirely... like? Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Okay, fine, Wolfie. Wolfie, you get face in your face. Face. I'm sorry, Jacob, but it had to be done. Uh, okay, I don't know where I'm going. Oh, hey, the town is not that far. I'm actually going to make it. I think it's... Are my followers behind me? No, good. That's fine, then. I don't need followers anyway. They can abandon me anytime they want. I mean, it's kind of up to them what they... What they choose to do with their free time. Well, this is lovely. It really is a nice, scenic area. Yeah, too bad it's named Pina Creek, though. Kind of breaks the whole scenic thing. It's not exactly a tourist, you know, attraction. You're like, so where are you guys going to stay? Oh, we're taking a trip up to Pina Creek. Yeah, the place smells funny all the time, and the water is a little bit yellow. Ah, ah we're, I'm going weird places today. Oh, oh, hello. Um... Apparently, there was a lot of slaughter happening and murder, and I missed it. Instead of actually being here for the action, I was you in a cave! And I'll kill you if you don't. Oh, yeah, this cat. Oh, look at his little tail. Oh, he's a little okay, cat okay. person. They're at Fort Uruk. He wanted them taken there, but I, I don't know why. I oh, right. Well, let's go why. to Fort Uruk, well. wherever you said. We'll go do that now. Very this man's ready. face was purple. Possibly not entirely purple, just half of it purple. Well, it's like three-fourths of it purple. Kind of. Uh, Two-thirds. Failed. failed what? 
Hey, good, good of you guys to show up. Oh, you're looking so good, Mag. Look at that red cape. Look at that. Oh, it's got little. Oh, it's got little frill frills on the bottom, man. Did you find the book? Did you find? Who talks like that? Gabe is like, oh, did you find the book? Did you find it? If you did, I'll give it to you. Apparently, something's happening behind me. I can't turn around because I'm in a dialogue. So we're going to sit here and talk like calm human individuals while who knows what's going on behind me, possibly killing all my followers and all your friends. But we're going to sit here and talk instead. Okay, I'm just I'm gonna spam through this dialogue so I can find out what's happening behind me. What's happening behind me? What is that? Oh, it's one of those things. Great, thanks, Merrick. Thanks for bringing those along. All because Merrick's in our party. The Hermaeus Moore or whatever the heck has been trying to kill us for who knows how long. Oh, hey, a horse. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm getting so distracted. Okay, is everyone dead? Oh, yay! The 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 roof of the thing is on fire with ice. It's ice fire. You looking so good. Hey, I didn't even know that your your head your head gym thing actually matches your cape kind of. That's awesome. It's really awesome. What? Oh, it was me coughing. Never mind. Hi, I'm talking to myself. Oh, hello, Tartus. You looking good today, Tartus. Um. Okay, now what? What does it say? What? No, that's a, no, that's it, it's a horse. You say that to a you say that to a fox, not a horse. Ho horses talk in Morse. Not 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 the fox. You gotta ask the fox that, not the horse. Hello. Hello. Oh, yeah. are you wearing your bathrobe? Please tell me you're wearing something underneath that. Oh, that's that's terrifying. I'm gonna go over here instead. Oh, I'm sorry. Are you guys talking? That's okay. Just continue with your talking. I'm gonna go over here. I'm going to go over here. Looks lovely here, doesn't it? Looks like. Oh, hello, sir. Are you a blacksmith? Can you make me a shiny pair of underwear? Possibly fireproof and bulletproof. It would help so much, sir. Why is he, sir? I think he's deaf and possibly blind. That's okay. I'm not gonna pick on deaf and blind people. Oh, sir, I'm ready. Will you help us attack Fort Of course, I'll do whatever. Yes, we, we will go. Yes, let's cliffs. attack Lord the fort of the whole hospital. We are going to break in. Why is he talking while walking away from me? He's like, talk to the butt. I'm like, I don't want. To. What? Where are we going? Which way we're we going? Uh. Apparently we're going this way. Okay, everyone, come on. We're going this way. We travel uh, southeast. I don't even know which way southeast. Can I have a horse? Anyone can if I have a horse? I mean, if, if I'm going to help you, can I? No, of course I can't. You guys are jerks. Why? Come on. I'm, I've decided to help you. I'm giving you everything you can. Just let me borrow a horse. I'll bring it back. It'll probably be dead, but I'll bring it back. You guys can keep the meat or whatever. Do people even eat horse meat? I'm sure somewhere in the world someone eats horse meat. It'd probably be valuable to one of you. That is all for this time. It looks like I'm not going to be able to find Jin and or uh, who's the other person that's missing. Yeah, Anna. I'm really bad. I got too many followers. But I'm not going to be able to find him yet because we're going to attack a fort or something first. But if you guys enjoy, leave a like, leave a comment, and I'll see you next time.